welcome back to another vlog and in this vlog as mentioned in the previous vlog we are on our way to Kaziranga we first went to pick a friend and then we left for the trip so right now we are stuck in the traffic and you can see me being all restless but okay the Guwahati traffic as usual The best part about the trip to Kaziranga is the route. I mean, both sides of the road filled with trees, the animal corridors that we crossed was just so beautiful. And here we are. Nice. We've reached our guest house, the Kazironga guest house Kohara. And we are unpacking right now. So we've reached Kazironga and I look really like a mess. Can't help it. Let's unload. Rook, 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 my lady. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. And this is our room, room for the girls. A small mini room tour you can say guys. I know this doesn't count as a room tour but this is all I could get. <laughs> oh my god. We were pretty hungry when we reached Kaziranga so we came up looking for food and we found this place John's kitchen. And here you can see me being confused over what to order but nevertheless we ate after such a long gap so we ate way too much than our normal capacity and we were quite full you know like till the time of dinner. That's my friend guys ah. showing off his tummy. His prized possession. <laughs> Look. So this place had decent food guys, John's Kitchen. Very nice. Oh, we have to go to the I know it sounds kiddish but swings are always one's best friends. Like when we were kids, we loved swinging and that habit never goes. Don't you agree with me guys? And nevertheless, I pulled in my friend as well. So we both were singing, swinging, sorry, and we had a good time. We chatted about so many things. We talked about so many things. We were quite philosophical, you know. And then I don't know what made me take a photo while swinging. Quite dumb. Of me. And then of course, I did insist my friend to take a photo of me in the background. I thought I looked really good, and I thought the background was quite apt for a good photography for, for a good photograph I don't know what's with me but yeah so yes my friend also came in to take my photograph that's a sweet offer we returned back to the lodge and we were just sitting in the room and having a nice time catching up again so much to catch up on guys i don't know when friends meet after a long time we have a lot to catch up on and you may remember this friend i was annoying her in the last video and i am still annoying her in this video which i can't help i've been annoying her since school days 
and soon after all this chit chatting my other friend looks very busy my friends my are working on a trip who has a diagnosis of very serious friends i've got and then there is this friend ulta wala truck ke baitha hai banda ka idea mein hai apna idea mein get in charge एक और है एक और गायब है वो नहा रहा है The safari was a highlight of the trip guys and the safari began with us being a little late but nevertheless we were there it started on a very green note as you can see and the first animals that we spotted were the elephants that they use for the animal, uh, elephant safari and that happens early in the morning well we didn't go for that well inside the forest it's really pretty i mean when you see greenery you would always love it so that's how it begins that's an elephant um sorry that's a rhino if you can spot it and that was the closest we saw the rhino and we also did have another instance where we did see a parent rhino and a baby rhino crossing the road but sadly i don't have it captured but enjoy this clip So we saw a rhino cross, a mud, a parent and a baby rhino, and it was such a cute moment. And we we'll come down. This Friends, prepping up for a photo. <laughs> the photographer with the iPhone. And this is the whole thing. We've been up there for the view. Moving on to that spot, we again spotted another parent and a baby rhino. This time, immersed in the water and enjoying the summer sun. And then we spotted many birds and a wild buffalo immersed in the water body again. And many deers were there, elephants were there, and we also spotted turtles. Oh, yeah, baby, look at the tiger claws. टाइगर क्लॉज है टाइगर क्लॉज है मतलब ही क्लीन दिस नेल्स ने नाखून साफ किया है ओ ये तो देखा से और ये जो भी है पीछे रहा हां तो बहुत जो है साइंटिस्ट ने अंदर से पीछे रहा न्यूकल नेम कोरिया अच्छा And just like that after 2 hours the safari comes to an end we return to the hotel and we get our breakfast served breakfast is simple and soon after breakfast we check out from the lodge and then we carry on with the journey After having checked out from the hotel, we now come to our next stop, the Kazironga National Orchid and Biodiversity Park. And uh, the highlight of this park is the orchid garden with several varieties of orchids. And that's what you would see in the video. So, we are in the orchid park of Kazironga and the variations of orchids you would see here so much sorry if any one of you is a plant lover no who loves orchids and all you ought to come to this place it's worth it i say it's worth it and the best time to come to this place is in march because at that time this whole garden is in full bloom But right now also being in the end of april it's still in bloom but march is the best
This out here is the world's smallest orchid. My camera is trying very hard to focus, but okay. The, it is a leafless orchid and it is the world's smallest orchid and was present in the garden. It was very cute to watch, to see it. Now moving on, this is the Kopo Fool. We all know what it is. Our symbolism of Bihu, the, for the Assamese people I mean. Moving on from the garden, we are now in the material museum where we came across many things used in the ancient times. The most fascinating thing for me was were the spelling queens towards the left of the screen that you can see. I'm sorry for the bad captures that I've been taking for these bad shots but uh, sorry, this is what I have. These are wooden utensils that were used back in the day. And such ancient, uh, many such ancient things were on display. Moving on, uh, we just wanted to take a stroll around the campus now since we were already there but uh, also we had to keep in mind that we were getting late and we had a long journey back to Guwahati. So it's just a quick tour of the entire space, that's my friend enjoying his swing, right you can say. And here is us exploring the entire space. They were having some cultural programs so we were just trying to like I uh, think if we would like to join in or not. We left soon after but uh, we had one more place to go before leaving for Pohati. So we rushed back soon and that place is Bokakhat, famous for its pera. So this is a clip of the Bokakhat bus stand. I didn't take the entire shot but yeah just to show that I was there. On our way back from Bokakhat to Guwahati, we saw this very pretty place. Like it had bougainvillea trees. So me and my friends waited and uh, we just wanted to take photos around. As you can see, it's a very pretty place. Yes, there you go, these trees, the highlight of the place. So everyone was busy taking photos, then uh, yes, that's what a pretty place makes us do. And that's my friend wanting a photo in the middle of the street but running away for his life. And with that, we come to end to the end of the vlog. On our way back, we waited for we halted for lunch, trying to use fancy words, guys. And that's it. That's the end of the vlog. The place where we had lunch is called um, Chopal. Yes, that's the signboard, guys. It's called Chopal. It's still, I think, in Kohara itself. So make sure to visit that place when you go to Kaziranga. And see you all until next time.